Welcome back to NGTV Plays, Salt and Sanctuary, featuring myself, Spencer, my co-host, Matt. We just made it to the Sanctuary in the Sunken Keep, I believe. Woo. And now we're going to head uh, out here towards the Majester. We're going to head up through here to the left. And I think there's an illusory wall. A circle? Yep. And then there's the Stone Merchant, the Pack of Salts. Oh, good, because we need to put a head up. We exit a to Stone the Merchant. Yeah. That place. Oh, forest bang. So we head up and to the left. Oh shit, I don't have any sound. Oh. Why do I shoot anything? And we had it we, should, we, should, we need to head up and left. So. Up, up, up and to the left. Oh my god, he's, he's fucking me. Shoot him. Shoot him. We'll take three hits. You get force fangs. Oh, they're like throwing knives. Yeah. There's a boss all the way up there? Oh, uh, that's the Majester. Mm. I guess we'll have to go take the fucking ladder. Stone leader. leader. Alright, well, okay. I guess we're ready. Oh, shit. I didn't realize it would start right away. We got this. Oh, this is a false gesture. Sorry. We're fine. I just tried to tech that. Dude, I Dumb. fucked him. Fuck you, I need that money. Oh shit, I forgot that we we just, we just pick it up for ourselves. Alright. This way, I would assume. Uh, um, giving us tips on how to fight this guy. <laughs> After feeding the boss, keep going left. Take the upper exit on the left side. Climb up the long stairs inside to find the mad gesture. And then once we get there, do not say anything. And I need to read like what we're supposed to say. They keep heading up, right? I believe so. Well, I yes. can't talk to him, so. Greetings, friend. You've come to chatter? From where I sit, you seem the matter. Fork, spoon, knife, and a drowned man's wife. This guy is crazy. Choose yes in your dialogue to give uh, to have him gift you the Vertigo brand. This brand grants its owner, blah, blah, blah. And then um, chest to left holds the gesture stuff. Cool. Where I come from is in is out, down is up, and up is down. Plate, clip, bowl, and a broken window soul. He just says stuff. He's not a real rhymer. Would you like this rich perspective? Trust me, Lord, it's quite authentic. Elbow, jaw, knee, and a grave beneath the sea. Yes. If you're not, then extend your hand. There's great power in a brand. White, searing, hot, and an iron forge thought. Ah, fuck my hand! Right through my glove! Should have taken off my glove! We've been branded. Now we can go upside down. Boop. We gotta go up here. Oh, thanks, bro. Wait, is there anything down here? No, I don't think. Over shields. Anything? Did you press circle over I here? I did. I did. Okay, there's something else that we can get there. Um, Port yourself to the top from there. Keep heading left of the hill until you find yourself in a cave with a lever that unlocks the gate. Ah, it's this way. Perfect. Just takes you back to the Festering Banquet. From here, continue going left, past the merchant, and then make your way through the Festering Banquet back to the Bandit's Pass. 
or you can go back to where the Mad Jester was, then head right back down to the cave. At the other end, you'll find another obelisk. Use it to reach the ceiling above and head right into the cave. This will bring you directly underneath the Venice Pass. So, at left... Well, we should go level. Or should I just, like... Just, yeah. Bell? Yeah. Oh, you already have, have the bell up there. there. Where is it? There it is. Yeah. Pretty simple stuff, dude. Hey, man! Level up! Dude, that false jester? I might just this. Yeah, sure. We'll get that. That. Boom. Oh, magic. Cool. Let me take a look at my rings real quick. I got Link of Fire and Sky, which nullifies elemental imbalance, which is good. And I'm wearing the Bandage Ring, which reduces wounding effect. Thing. Oh, Lord. A uh, conduit of mine, which locks minimum. Oh, that's right. It locks the minimum stamina to one third of the stamina. Um, but it, it like raises my focus like a ton. Then I go ahead and uh, plop the uh, shopkeeper down here. Make sure it's the right one. Or touching. Yeah. And anyway, we gotta keep the keep them both open so we can do them. I'm um, an alchemist here. Okay, so do we want to head? Do you want to go where we just go back to the Mad Jester and then head right back and down to the cave at the other end? You'll find an, an, another obelisk. Reach the ceiling above and head right into the cave. Sure. Alrighty. Gotta find the, the the obelisk. Silver shield. Hmm. Better fire. Oh, 100%. better holy and and uh, arcane and poison yeah. defense, but worse everything else. So maybe just switch to it if you need holy and arcane defense. Yeah. Poison. Yep. Okay. So let's head back over to the jester. Wasn't the jester this way? No, it's up here and then left. Ah, fuck. Now that he just committed suicide. Let's go. Oh, this is Festering Banquet? I think so. Alright, well. Well, shit. Oh, I should probably should not have lit this. Nice. This leads, I'm assuming, oh, okay. Oh, might as well grab that. What if I can just, I totally can. Ah, that's funny. Oh, this is where we had to go anyways. Give me that. Stone, Stone alchemist. alchemist. We should just go back and use it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we can't, we gotta travel back. Well, it's just like right over here. Ah, oh, dude, it's too far. Can't make it, man. Where we fought the dude.
Are we heading this way? Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. I thought it was you. You're doing a lot of damage, dude. All the way down? Uh, shit. I don't remember. No, it's not. This way. Okay, make an offering. Stone alchemist. Nice. Right. Where you at, bitch? Do what we got here. Um. Buster sword. I can only do my arming sword, solid branch, and, and, and bullwhip. I can have my bullwhip? Oh, you go down. I can do an antler baton. I an amber idol. I can make my arming sword a Varangian Spatha, but I don't have a class 1 sword. Bull whip. I can make stuff, but I. You don't have a uh, amber idol. No, well, no, it's not that. I can make stuff, but I, I can't use them. Like I can make myself a whip or a sword, but I don't have this whip or sword stuff. And I could make a. For the uh, the the wand, I need to have an amber idol. Let me look at some. Uh... Wait for the page load. Okay, look at some. What can you make? Oh, the shrouded bulwark. Oh, you need that. Oh, you can do it. You just don't, don't have enough souls. You're actually pretty close. We should just go kill some stuff and you can make it. Yeah, I know, but like, this is strength scaling D. Uh huh. But then, like, this is strength, or strength scaling S. That's true. Um, but how much more damage does it do? A lot. I think that's why it, it scales worse. Because it has, like, a, a bigger boost initially. So, I guess. I can do. You can do it for like right now. This one, and I can do this one. What is the fucking, what is the bird? What is the bird? I don't understand the bird. Yeah, I don't understand the bird either. I think, I think it's like, well, what we were saying before, like, like one's base damage and one's you're like, when your stats get added to it. I'm looking for a staff. I make myself a staff. Need to find a staff so I don't waste too much time. Okay, so the staffs do require Amber Idol. I need court sorcerers here, so I think in the next area I can, I can, I can get the Rowan Crozier. Nice. And then later I'll do some research on uh, other weapons that aren't stabs that uh, that um, go with magic. You know. Mm -hmm. So did you want to try to get one of those or? No. No. Not right now. I'll do it at, before next episode or after next episode. Because I want to know what the bird shit is. I got you. I don't want to waste too much time in the episode to actually look that shit up. Boom! Knives. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Then I survived. Oh wait, where do we have to go? Um, it really matters which, which direction we take to get to it. We just, I think we just head across here. Wait, no, 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 no. Okay, no yeah, no. we yeah. gotta head across this way and then and then head up and to the right, right? Yeah. Right here. Up to here. Okay, bandit's pass. Oh yeah. I like how you go and kill it after it's already been spent, like you're teaching it a lesson. Okay. Woohoo! Almost. Okay, so we're using it to reach the Castle of Storms. As soon as you climb up the hill, you will see a ladder. Okay, so no matter which way you take, just head to the rightmost end of the pass to reach the Castle of Storms. 
As soon as you climb up the hill, you will see a ladder leading to a locked door. If you want, you can use a bronze key to unlock the door to obtain the outlaw great, ax great axe and a satchel of salt. Watch out, there's like traps and shit. What's that like, like fire thing that keeps happening when you kill people? That's you. That like whoosh thing? Yeah. Hey, I bet you that's probably good for me. Oh, shit. You keep knocking him away. Oh, sorry. Found merchant. Nice. What's what's over here? Nothing. Oh, it's Gary. Nothing's this way, so we just gotta head back up. Maybe we gotta head up and then to the right. Like oh, when the fire gets there's together. A trap. There's traps. Fuck. Ow. Start. You got a bronze key. Oh, good. No, that was stupid. Man, you do a lot of damage. I better because I'm like, I, I, I take so much damage. Are we supposed to take the elevator to the castle? Um, it says that. I think we just go through here and then we're there. Oh yeah, this is where we we're outside and then we, we have to take the obelisk across. Mm -hmm. That's right, so we need to head up a ladder or something like that to open up the door right here. Really blended that in. Hey, Outlaw Grey X. Check out that X to see if it's good for you. Ooh, two-handed axe. It does do more damage than you, but it's also a two-handed axe. So. I mean, like, what are you going to do, right? Even if I two-handed, it's still... Yeah, yeah it, when it has two Xs, it means you can't use it at all. If it has one X, oh, one slash, it means that uh, you can't one-hand it. And we're in the Castle of Storms. But before we go too far. Okay. Is there a sanctuary nearby? Because I got a level. Good ladder. Uh, obelisk reach to the other side of the broken bridge. Bring yourself straight into the castle. But before you go, after activating the obelisk, head to the left. Oh, fuck. To reach the area above, holds three times shock stone and a bag of salt. Fuck. Can you make that jump, man? I mean, probably. Yeah. Head left. So bad. I'm bad. Nice. Now we head in. Then there, I thought I flew past you. That would've been crazy. All right, I'm gonna head into Castle Storms, and I gotta open up another page so we can just maybe not go too far, but wander a little bit, fight some things. Oh my God! Fuck! One sec, one sec, one sec. What does he say about this thing? It will. I mean, me and Cold. Keep heading fun. right until you find a long set of three stairs going up. Keep going up the stairs to the very top, fighting the Ember Skull and Cage Man. Uh, at the very top, head left to exit the current room. You'll see another set of long stairs going up towards the court sorcerer. Maybe him. And head right. Okay, so not really. There's. Okay, so it's kind of close. It's like after a bunch of stuff. Oh, the bandit 
way places like right over here. We might as well just go visit there first. Got you. Ah, fuck. Watch. Oh, running through fields. Is that the one I want to do? We're gonna have to find anything. Oh, we do. Okay. Well, we're about to heal, so it doesn't matter. I didn't stand a chance. Get straight. Oh, yes, we do. No. Yeah, last time I was, I, I made like a like a definite no <laughs> answer to that. They'll probably just get another enhanced magic. Where the fuck do you get gray axes at? Is that in the maces shit? Yes. Oh, that is stupid. Stupid. And you have to get the second level of it to be able to two-hand it. Where's the... I would get the first one first, though, because you get, like, strength ups and stuff. Oh. Well, I guess one strength up. Yeah, but I don't know if it's even worth it. Totally up to you, man. You want to call an episode here? Here, one second. So much strength up. So that's your your path yeah. to uh, the swords. The dark side. So how does dexterity go with what you're doing? Are, are you going straight, like a lot more strength than dexterity at the moment, or I guess all swords like they scale with both strength, strength and dex, right? Some of them. I don't know if all of them do. You can go down to magic. You could. You grab magic user, and then you could get yourself like a fireball to toss at people for ranged. Or maybe you should get um, the throwing knives thing. The assassin throwing knives. What part is? Wait. All right. Alrighty, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, hit like button if you want to see some more. Subscribe. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.